Steve, they are. We can see there are still a handful of police here on Maple Street. They've still got up yellow police tape, and they're still blocking off Maple Street all the way down to Beach Street, asking folks trying to drive through this area to find a different way. Now, we know the students in the students and staff inside of Central High School were asked to stay in place for several hours this afternoon, but the AG's office has said there are no signs pointing to any students being involved in this incident. Police have said the stay in place order was meant to be a safety measure considering how close this incident happened to the high school. The New Hampshire AG's office has ruled this death suspicious, but there haven't been any specific details released on exactly what happened here. But they do say there were no firearms involved. So far, we know just after 1 o'clock this afternoon, Manchester Police, Fire, and American Medical Rescue crews responded to this area on Lowell and Mace, Maple Streets, where one person suffered life-threatening injuries. And we now know that person was taken to Elliott Hospital in critical condition before they were pronounced dead. Earlier at the scene, we saw police blocking off both Lowell and Maple streets. They had yellow police tape up while they and a canine surveyed the area. We will have more information as soon as the AG's office continues their investigation into what happened here, but so far they do say they haven't said anything about suspects or any arrests being made. We're live in Manchester. Imani Fleming, WMUR News 9.